Dear students, let me present to you an example of the application of the hypergeometric distribution. The example is as follows. The names of five men and five women are written on slips of paper and placed in a hat. Four names are drawn. What is the probability that two are men and two are women? Now, if there is a problem in front of you, how do you know that you should apply the hypergeometric formula, apply the binomial formula, apply the binomial formula, apply the binomial apply the binomial formula? This is a very, very important point, that you should have to apply the problem statement to the problem आप रिकॉग्नाइज कर सकें कि यहां पे कौन सी डिस्ट्रीब्यूशन एप्लीकेबल है तो देखिए हम इसको दोबारा पढ़ते हैं लेट्स ट्राई लेट्स ट्राई लेट अस सी लिखा हुआ है कि द नेम्स ऑफ फाइव मेन एंड फाइव वुमेन आर रिटन ऑन स्लिप्स ऑफ पेपर एंड प्लेस्ड इन अ हैट फोर नेम्स आर ड्रॉन तो अब आप बताएं मुझे कि पॉपुलेशन क्या है ऑब्वियसली 5 plus 5 10, yani wo five men or five women together, they constitute the population. And capital N is equal to 10. Uske baad ye jo baat hai ki four names are drawn, then it is obvious that small n, the sample size, is equal to 4. Ab uske baad ye wali baat ki what is the probability that out of these four names that have been drawn, Two are men and two are women. Is me baat ye hai students ke aap ko khud se decide karna padega ke aap kis cheez ko success kahenge aur kis ko failure. If you want, you may regard getting uh, the name of a man as success and getting the name of a woman as failure. Aur agar aap chahe to iske opposite bhi kar sakte hai. The final result will come out to be the same as long as you have done your calculations correctly. Hi, sorry, baat ke andar, ek ahem baat maine kehne se reh gai, jo mein ab zaroor kahungi, ke agar che yahan kahin pe nahi likha hua, ke sampling is being done without replacement, lekin ye understood hai, kyunke real life mein, jab bhi aap kisi group में से कुछ आइटम या कुछ लोग सिलेक्ट करते हैं तो हम मैं या आप ऐसे तो नहीं करते ना कि एक को सिलेक्ट किया और फिर उनको वापस डाल दिया रिप्लेस कर दिया और फिर दोबारा भी वही आ जाएं वी डोंट डू दैट जनरली इन जनरल व्हेन वी आर सैंपलिंग इन रियल लाइफ सिचुएशंस द सैंपलिंग इज बीइंग डन विदाउट रिप्लेसमेंट so, our four conditions are fulfilled. Number one, every draw will result in a success or a failure. Why? Because every slip of paper that I will pull out of that hat will either be carrying the name of a man, success, or the name of a woman, failure. Ugly condition, that the number of draws is fixed. Well. We have said that we are going to draw four names. Four. Small n is equal to four. Ye bhi ho gaya. Ab ye ke I need the third parameter of the hypergeometric distribution, which is k. Or k kya hota hai? The number of successes in the population at the beginning of the experiment. So, abhi shuru mein humare paas das wo hai naam aur unme se paanch naam jo hai they are of men so therefore successes ki tadad paanch hai k is equal to 5 dear students now that we have got all these things right there is still one more thing that we must consider right now it's better if we do it right now aur wo kya hai वो ये है कि should my x column start from zero and then one two and so on 
should it go up to small n or should it go up to k to iska jawab yahi hai na ke if k is less than small n then my column will go up to k but if k is greater than small n then my column will go up to small n is particular example ke andar small n is equal to 4 and k is equal to 5 therefore my column of x values number of successes in the sample will go from 0 to 4 0 1 2 3 अब दूसरा कॉलम दैट इज द कॉलम ऑफ द प्रोबेबिलिटीज दैट आई हैव टू कंप्यूट अप्लाइंग द हाइपरजोमेट्रिक फॉर्मूला एंड ऑफ कोर्स आफ्टर आई हैव कैलकुलेटेड ऑल ऑफ देम आई शुड ऐड देम एंड द सम हैज टू बी इक्वल टू 1 सो लेट अस कंसीडर द फॉर्मूला व्हाट इज द फॉर्मूला और द पीएमएफ of the hypergeometric distribution it is kcx capital n minus k c small n minus x over capital n c small n and of course jab main ye c keh rahi hu to aap achhi tarah jante hain ki i am talking about combination so yahan pe kcx ki jagah pe 5cx उसके बाद कैपिटल एन माइनस के टेन माइनस फाइव और उसके नीचे क्या है स्मॉल एन माइनस एक्स यानी फोर माइनस एक्स सो टेन माइनस फाइव मीन्स फाइव और नीचे फोर माइनस एक्स फाइव सी फोर माइनस एक्स ये दोनों ऊपर न्यूमिरेटर में हैं और आप इसमें मल्टीप्लाई हो रहे हैं एंड इन द डिनोमिनेटर वट डू वी नीड कैपिटल एन सी स्मॉल एन यानी टेन सी फोर सो नाउ नाउ दैट आई हैव माई फॉर्मूला ऑल आई हैव टू डू इज टू स्टार्ट पुटिंग वैल्यूज ऑफ एक्स जीरो वन टू थ्री फोर एंड कंप्यूट एंड गेट ऑल द प्रॉबिलिटीज द सम ऑफ विच विल कम आउट टू बी वन लेकिन यहां जो प्रॉब्लम था ये तो मैंने आपको इसलिए बताया कि ताकि आप पूरी डिस्ट्रीब्यूशन आपके सामने आ जाए और उसका ग्राफ भी आप बना लें लेकिन अदरवाइज स्टूडेंट्स इस एग्जांपल में क्या क्वेश्चन था द क्वेश्चन वाज व्हाट इज द प्रोबेबिलिटी दैट आउट ऑफ दोज फोर स्लिप्स दैट वी हैव पुल्ड आउट ऑफ दैट हैट टू कंटेन द नेम्स ऑफ मैन and two contains contain the names of women to so, chuke success jo hai that is uh, the name of a man to so, uski tadad is jumle ke andar jo maine abhi ada kiya kya hai it is two two men two men so that means ke agar humne sirf is particular question ko answer karna hai to hum baki values x ki na bhi rakhe aur sirf x ko two put kar de that will give us the answer to this particular question now it is in front of you on the screen and the probability that capital x is equal to 2 is equal to 5c2 multiplied by 5c4 minus 2 divided by 10c4 isko aap solve kar lijiye and what is the final answer that you get it is 10 by 21 a little less than 50% so agar hum ye khwahish hamari ye thi ki agar population ke andar panch naam mardon ke aur panch khawateen ke hain to hamare sample ke andar bhi isi tarah balance ho jaye jabki hum random sampling kar rahe hain to this probability of this happening is almost 50% i will finish the discussion by throwing to you the idea that you may compute all the probabilities and then draw the graph 
of the hypergeometric distribution. I am presenting to you right now a few graphs of the hypergeometric distribution. This example mein jo aapke saamne hai, jo graphs dikh rahe hai, capital N is equal to 500 and K is changing. In the first graph, K is equal to 50 uh, and the, in the second one, it is 100. Then we have 250, 400 and 450. Or just small n here, the third parameter, that is the same for all the graphs and that is equal to 30. So, you can see that the hypergeometric distribution is the shape of the change mumkin hota hai. As you can see, in one instance, it is positively skewed and in another one, it is negatively skewed. And the one in the middle that is like symmetric. So, abhi jo humne example discuss kiya hai, uski probabilities nikal kar, uska graph draw kije, and find out for yourself what is the shape of your this particular hypergeometric distribution. 